Hi, this is a follow-up uh, lesson video for your previous worksheet that you worked on on June 3rd and now yesterday you actually did hear about the Iyo Tenki desu ne and then you should have worked on this worksheet now um, so let's look at this worksheet now and we're gonna go through it and then we're gonna go over the answers okay so now so the first sentence is kyo wa ii o tenki desu ne kyo wa ii o tenki desu ne now you did hear this sentence now this first in this paragraph again in your worksheet and it should say uh, by the way you might want to circle your section period all right and you might want to put your name so that when you actually put it in your uh, folder I can come down and check all right now and it should say video lecture number one and then from video one so keep that in mind it's right here right here now so you should see the first sentence kyo wa ii o tenki desu ne kyo wa ii o tenki desu ne and then it says watashi wa emily desu now let's think about this statement a little bit now again kyo wa is today but wa is a subject right so it's today today it's just as a subject now e means good o tenki desu ne o tenki desu ne today's weather is good isn't it right now watashi wa emily desu watashi wa emily desu what does this mean well watashi means I and Emily this. This is always a concluding statement. Watashi wa Emily this. Means is, in this case, I am, is or am. In this case, it's a proverb, so Watashi wa Emily this. I am Emily. Otegami arigato. Now, Otegami, what is this word? And you did actually see the new words, new words says otegami means letter again o makes it polite so tegami itself means letter but again otenki or some people say tenki adding o makes it polite so since we re since this person is replying to a letter <coughs> um, the person says otegami just being polite you can you could say tegami by the way all right otegami arigato otegami arigato Arigato. Yes. What does it mean? Means, thank you. Watashi wa Arwin PA ni sundeimasu. Watashi wa Arwin PA ni sundeimasu. Again, ni is a particle. Ni is a particle. Sundeimasu. Live in. So in this case, live in Arwin. So who is living in? What's the subject here? Watashi wa. Again, watashi wa makes it a subject. So that case, I live in Arwen. All right. Next statement. Watashi wa midori no kiga suki desu. Let's say it, everyone. Try it. Ready? I'll 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 say it and you repeat. Ready? I'll give you. Uh, moment so that you can actually repeat okay for each word watashi wa midori no ki ga suki desu one more time watashi wa midori no ki ga Suki desu. Okay. Now, watashi wa is a subject. Watashi means I, midori no. Midori no. Midori is green. Ki ga, ki means tree. Suki desu like as a verb so something something ga suki desu remember something something 
something が好きです。The pronunciation is listed in here. So, but something something が好きです means I like or she likes. In this case, I as a subject, 私は。So, I like something something. In this case, 緑の木。What's 緑の木 ?The green tree. Right? Now, next sentence. 私も漫画が好きです。私も漫画が好きです。What does this も mean? Now, 私も yes. も means to. So, 私も If it's 私は that makes it subject I. It's still a subject, but it's sort of like you're saying I too. Or me too, more or less. I like, oh,、well, in this case, I too like manga. Manga in this case, the manga is a Japanese comic book. So, 私も I myself like a comic book. More, it's sort of like too. I like a comic book too. Alright? So, 私も keep that in mind, more. 私も Alright? 私も。Okay, this is a particle for more like to, right? Something, something to like my case, me too, right? 私も。Right? 漫画が好きです。Right? Now, 明日 tomorrow, 一緒に。What is 一緒 This word pops up a lot. 一緒 together. 映画へ行きましょう。映画へ行きましょう。Again, you have it here, so I'm just gonna write it in Japanese. Alright, watch carefully. E, E, Ga, E. Alright? Ikimasho. Can you read it? E, Ga, E, Ikimasho. Alright? Now, so E, Ga, E. This part right here is written as E. Because it's pronounced as e instead of he. This part right here is actually written as he. It's he, no matter how you look at it, but it's actually pronounced as e. Alright? Keep that in mind. Because again, a ga, if you hold the vowel here, ga, ga at the end. It's gonna be a vowel, anyways. So, e ga, e ga he ikimasho. It's hard to say. So, again, the language developed such that it's e ga e ikimasho. It's a little bit easier to say. So, Japanese people use e instead. So, e ga e ikimasho. Alright? So, now, so what does it mean? What it means, well, today is a good weather, isn't it? I am Emily. Thank you for your letter. Or thank you for the letter. I live in Irvine, PA. Well, I'm living in Irvine, PA. I like a green tree. I too like manga. Or I like manga too. And tomorrow,、uh, let's go to a movie. Right? Ikimasho. Let's go. Tomorrow, let's go to a movie. Alright? So, I hope you actually went over this. And what I'd like you to do now is to come up with a sentence. And in hiragana. So, and write it down at the bottom of this. So, now you have a sentence that you can make. And if you have already made it, let's try to say it in Japanese. And let's try to share it with your、uh, nearby friends. Right? So, you know, you can say something about, I like something something too. There's an expression, I like something something too. Or you can say, I live in, I don't know, north side? I don't know. Alright? Anything you can come up with. And let's write it in here again. You can start writing in Romaji first, in alphabets, in Japanese pronunciation, and you can convert to hiragana. Right? That itself is an exercise. 